History was made today as America's first black astronaut candidate finally made it to space. This morning at 7.30, Ed Dwight also became the oldest person to make the journey. These are the pictures from the launch, the landing, and look at that reaction. Here's ABC's Gio Benitez with how he got to the edge of space after being denied his chance six decades ago. He never made it to space 60 years ago, but that all changes today. Air Force test pilot Ed Dwight was nominated by President John F. Kennedy in 1961 to become the first black astronaut. My hope was just getting into space in any kind of way, but they were not going to let that happen. When Kennedy was assassinated, Dwight's path to space evaporated. Number one, I wasn't tall enough. I was Catholic. I wasn't black enough. I was not the model of the Negro race. I was a one-man operation when the president announced to the world that he was going to announce a black astronaut. This morning, Ed Dwight, now 90 years old, a celebrated sculptor and author, reaching for the stars, launching on Blue Origin's rocket from West Texas. Dwight, along with five fellow travelers, will partake in an 11-minute odyssey that will propel them into the realm of weightlessness. Veteran astronaut Charlie Bolden sending along a special message ahead of Dwight's big day. I want you to just take take some time while you're while you're flying just to suck it all up and take it all in you deserve every moment of this uh, you've been a role model and a mentor for many of us needless to say i am overwhelmed and this opportunity is once in a lifetime that i will cherish for the rest of my life